we're just keeping things quick and easy today. Bacon and eggs. That's it. All right, hey YouTube. Get started the day. Got a few things to do. Need to get that pen finished for the separation pigs and other things. You know how it is. A nice, another nice weekend day. A zero, a zero clouds. Zero clouds. Zero threatening weather. I don't think we're gonna have a problem this weekend. Might be a little warm though, but it's got a little bit of a breeze. Be a good day. Trash day is always fun. Or not. Getting loaded up is the hard part. Unloading it's easy. Alright. Doing some knots today. I haven't done a knot in a while. But uh, tying a tarp down here for some shade. For some chickens. The round turn two half inches is a pretty good standby, but sometimes a little harder knot more permanent what you want so what I've been doing I'm going into these gr grommets is a as a bowl line so you, whatever object you're going around bring it back and I've just put a round turn in here you can go through once or twice but just bring that loop over like that to where this is coming towards back towards it see that it's pretty simple then reach back through and where that long ends coming from Pull up the bite. It looks like that. And then that small pigtail you got coming out. That small pigtail you got coming through. Just bring it under that bite there. Like that. That folds back on itself. And then you can just pull from the running end. Well, if I can do this. So it looks like that. That tightens down pretty securely. I'm just gonna tighten this tarp down here. But just a quick knot for the day. We're gonna do a double fish or a single fisherman's here too for the second. Talk about joining ropes together. So reusing this baling twine where it's joined it won't come through these grommets. So what I'm gonna do is cut this out and I'm gonna rejoin the rope together using a single fisherman's. Let's look at that. Let's get a better example of that here. You see you got two ends you wanna join them together. Just gonna to take this. I always start with my left. Uh, it doesn't matter which way to start with. But just gonna do an overhand here to do a single fisherman. Like so. Oop. And that tightens down. And then, so, so I do the same thing twice, because it's technically the right way to do it. I just flip it over to do the other side. And then I've joined my two strings or ropes together. Like so. Then once I get them tight, then I just tighten them together. That's pretty much never coming out essentially there's a double fisherman's too which we can show um i'll do that separate a quick example of while we're using knots here using a clove hitch to isolate where this side's tied off using the same rope clove hitch it and this side's going to go to another grommet on a, over here across the way so i clove hitch this bar right here so that way there's tension here and they're not pulling on each other. All the tension goes on here. Just a tip, or just an example of how you can use that in the middle. Somebody brought me a smoothie and it's almost already gone. Oh yeah, that's good stuff. Blueberry. What else is in there? Hmm. Oh yeah, that's here's good. something different we're gonna plant, at least different for me. Sun choke. 
is what I would think they're called. Or that's what I was told at least. I don't know. I guess they get kind of tall like sunflowers but are kind of more branched off or something weird. And I don't know. Something different. We'll see how these do. So with all those big rains we had, the weeds have really popped up lately. Behind a bit on that. Our free goat removal doesn't necessarily get to roam everywhere. Otherwise we'd have no trees. Fortunately we still have goat disposal though. Weed disposal is important. Oh, they just love weeds. Come one, come all. <laughs> Snack time. So it's a clear day today. It's a, it's a good thing it's windy. I was wondering why I felt so tired. It's weather, guys. It's daggum near 94, 95 degrees. It's too warm for me. The wind helps a little bit. It's like being in front of a hairdryer now. Summer is upon us. All right, hey YouTube. We're about ready to wrap this weekend up. I'm not even sure if half this stuff came out. It's been so windy. So this might be a short, 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 short vlog, depending on what comes out on the other end when we go to put this stuff together. But definitely getting some stuff done. Hope everybody's had a good one. Keep an eye out on your end. Hope everybody's getting their own work accomplished. There was a good uh, live stream today. Food Force Permaculture put together. I caught during a sit down break. He was uh, doing some juicing with them. Some of his, I think some of it was garden race stuff and some of the stuff he'd got at the market or whatever, but uh, it was good stuff, good discussion and whatnot. We'll get there one day. <clears throat> but I guess we'll wrap this vlog up. Hope everybody has a good, had a good weekend and we'll see you this week and see you in the morning. Live free.